Hey, welcome back. You made it to my new video. So I was uh, working with a group recently talking about different creative ways that we can use Google Slides. And one of them is to kind of create collaborative graphic novels. So this is a project I work on, worked on years ago where a group of high school students created a graphic novel version of Hamlet. As you can see here, it's really heavy on like analog drawings and there's screenshots or little scans of each summary of the act. So this is actually a really straightforward process to build. So that's what I wanna walk through in the, the video today is how to turn um, student work into kind of a published online graphic novel. So this is the process that we use and I think it could work really well um, because so many schools are using G Suite and Google Slides is a really familiar tool. So you can see here, I just simply have a set of slides. Now each slide is going to act as a page of the book. So you might wanna insert blank slides along the way to have placeholders. But essentially, any work that kids are doing offline, there's a few different ways you can get it into the slides. You could go insert image from front facing camera. I know the resolution and the quality is not ideal. What I might do if I had access to a phone or an iPad is either take pictures of the kind of offline drawings or scan the offline drawings with like a scanning app just to clean it up and make it look really nice. So this acts as the cover. Here's some work that they wrote out kind of in like a, a text document. We can screenshot that and dump it into the slides. And now all of the images along the way, these are really like offline creations that we can take photos of or scan and then get those images into Google Slides. The reason why I like to start in Google Slides is the building environment is it allows students obviously to collaborate. You might have students obviously now working at distance, right? They're not in the same place or they have to stay socially distant inside class where you might have one group working on one set of drawings for a particular scene. One group might be editing or doing the write up or the summary or writing kind of like the script of what the characters are going to say. And then we can kind of instantly collaborate in these spaces. So once that's created, there's only two more steps in the process from here. We're going to do file download as PDF and download this whole thing as a PDF file. And I take that step because if we head over to a site called issue, this is where I was earlier, with an issue account, what you're able to do is take a PDF, upload it, and then it looks like this. So now what we've done is turn Google Slides into this kind of published graphic novel version of the book. And again, this is nothing more than offline drawings, photo or scan with a secondary device, iPad, iPhone, Android phone, whatever you have, get those images into Google Slides, and then kids can kind of build and create and collaborate inside of the Slides environment, and then the final product is here. So now we have a kind of collaboratively built, published graphic novel of any concept that you like. So that was a quick one. I hope this idea helps. Feel free to subscribe to the channel. I'll keep cranking out as many videos as I can. And good luck making your own published graphic novel via Google Slides.